we have the magnificent, the one and only Earl Clue on the phone. Are you with us? Are you our guest of honor in jazz in a temple, Brother Earl? Uh, I guess so, tonight. Anyway, this is uh, <laughs> uh, going to be a lot of fun. Yes, indeed. We were so <laughs> glad that you could um, take time out of your busy schedule to call us. Oh, well, it's just great to uh, be on the line. Mm -hmm. great. You have been going strong for years and years and years, and you still sound so wonderful. You know how these um, musicians, they, um, they heal us with their music and their spirit and their personality. And your personality seems like kind of shy, kind of reserved, and you just let the music do the talking. Is that right? Pretty much. <laughs> That's a wonderful thing. So you will be in Atlanta uh, coming up this strong. I believe it's March the 3rd. Yes, Saturday. That's going to be a wonderful thing. And it's at the First Center for the Arts at Georgia Tech. You're going to be live in concert. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's going to be so awesome. And you got special guest Nelson Rangel? Uh, Rangel. Rangel, okay. Yes, he's a great sax saxophone player and a uh, flautist and uh, a great addition to my band. Yes, wonderful. Um, when's the last time you've been in Atlanta? Well, you know, actually, I live here. I've been here now for about 11 years. What? Have yeah. you been to WRG? Have you been to the studio? Oh, yeah. You have. Now, do we have your CD in the studio? Oh, I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> well, you got to make sure of that. And I got to check the closet over there to make sure we got your music. <laughs> <laughs> so you live here in Atlanta. You see how recluse you are. You're so quiet. Your music just says it all. And yeah, we're so happy cool. to have you on Jazz in the Temple. <laughs> oh, great to be here, for sure. <laughs> Wonderful. So your show this Saturday, you're going to be doing two sets or one? Um, uh, there will be an intermission. Okay. So, uh, uh, you know, it's, but it's just one continuous show. That's awesome. Let's tell us about your magnificent child prodigy background. Just bring us up to date because you have a lot of people who may listen to another, a whole lot of genres, but may not know who you are or what instrument that you play. So just fill us in, fill the family in. Oh, yeah, for sure. Well, I, uh, I'm a guitarist. I play uh, nylon string classical guitar. And, uh, you know, I have a very strong uh, background in music starting with uh, piano and uh, uh, I always wanted to play guitar that was my instrument of choice but my mom bought a piano first so I it was a good thing I was able to uh, take piano lessons for about five years and I write a lot of music you know a lot of my music on the piano to this day so uh, you know it's just uh, one of those things I just heard uh, classical guitar and that kind of field where I wanted to go as far as my music, you know, as far as the direction. And uh, I've been very, very fortunate to have a, a long, long career by most standards, you know, I'm uh, well into my, uh, let's see, when I started my career, 40, uh, 22, and I'm 58 now. So. I love it. I love yeah. it. Tell your age. Yes, I love it. Oh, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Give us the timeline. I mean, because greatness, you just be getting better and better and better because I'm close to your age and I've heard about you my whole lifetime. So that's just a wonderful thing to have that consistency, have that stay in power and have that tenacity to keep doing what you love is truly a gift. Oh, yeah, it is. It, it, every day. It mm -hmm. is a gift. That's for sure. Awesome. So do you have any new CDs and any new projects and how new are they? Well, you know, I've, I've got, uh, at last count, maybe 32 CDs over my career. And, uh, you know, I'm still active uh, recording. We travel internationally uh, and nationally. Mm. And, um, you know, we keep very busy. And uh, I really enjoy it. One of the things about uh, Atlanta, it was such a good city to, uh, you know, fly in and out of. Uh, you know, once I moved from Detroit, uh, it made it very, you know, quite a bit easier to travel with the airlines. You know, Delta is such a great airline, and uh, uh, it really allows you to uh, make things much easier. So I'm, I'm very happy, uh, uh, 
being here and being able to fly in and out and uh, uh, just continue what I've been doing all these all these many years, which is uh, playing nightclubs and uh, stadiums and uh, concert halls and the whole the whole thing. <laughs> Wow, you are so humble. You are so humble. We're talking to Mr. Earl Clue. He is a master of the nylon acoustic guitar and finger style technique. A guitarist with impeccable technique, and he will be here this Saturday, March the 3rd, live in concert at the First Center for the Arts at Georgia Tech. 